Alright, are you ready? Yes, I'm ready. What? Oh, you two. <laughs> right, I'm only joking, yes lads. Welcome back to my next video on my YouTube channel. Today is an active recovery day. I'm going to be taking you through what I'm going to be doing. I'm going to be hitting some cardio on the treadmill. And I'm also going to be doing some stretches. Because honestly, that's so important for recovery. That's something I know it's last few weeks. I'm recording the intro on the leg press. Because the roof is too shy to record anywhere else. But yeah, I'm going to get some cardio and I'll see you there. Like these are really good. 
I feel like they're really good for stretching out your spine and also really good for grip strength. As most of you will know by watching my deadlifts, my grip strength is absolutely dreadful. I can't deadlift without the straps and I feel like this is what's going to help me just get a little bit better. Lastly, what's good for dead pains, all you beta males who can't do your first pull up yet, it's basically the same position, so it's good practice. I'm joking. I'm going to do about 30 seconds, two sets. Right? Start at like 15 20, and you can build up from there. future now from the last clip you just saw a bit a bit different in today's video I just wanted to show you what my cardio routine looks like and I know I always preach in my videos about how important it is to stretch I wanted to actually show you lot what it's like what I actually do on these days where I do stretch which is more or less every day but yeah active rest day today I've been taking my rest days to do cardio and stuff in recent times and the reason being to this is because I'm, I'm really happy with my weight at the minute Honestly, like, I'm really hungry. I, I, I have a big appetite anyway, but I'm eating well, I'm sleeping decent, my training feels great, progress feels great, and I'm only young, so I don't feel like there's much point to cut at the minute. But I do feel like cardio is more important than people realise because one thing I've looked into a little bit and uh, com by using my own common sense, sort of noticed that. I feel like good cardio carries over to the weight room. So when I'm doing squats, for example, let's say I'm doing a set of 12 on 130, I could probably do like 15 reps of 130. But by the 10th rep, my cardio is so done, I'm just like, oh, I'm putting this weight back. So just by some decently intense cardio once or twice a week, I'm gonna eventually build it up. But as I said, I'm not trying to lose weight. I'm just trying to make the cardio carry over to the weight room which is just gonna make, lead to more gains for me, so you can't really go wrong. Yes, lads, but the last thing I wanna finish on just before I end the video is that I, I'm, I think I'm gonna switch the content up a little bit. I feel like it's too much of the same thing too often because my videos are all like three to six minutes long and it's just intro, montage, outro, and like there's not much to it. I wanna have more variety into my content, so I think the next few videos to come, be expecting more like guidance through my workout or you know a commentary over it just to switch it up a little bit you know because not only do you lads probably get bored of seeing the same stuff on every youtube channel but i'll get bored of making the same video every single week but on the same note don't be expecting like 20 minute videos because i don't want to waste you lads time i still want to you know make it productive entertaining and whatever you guys might be asking for so if you have any suggestions please comment it below right and until then See you next time.